Uh, my name's David, I'm the Medical Director and I'm here to talk to you about a new initiative in the Trust to help improve the support given for junior doctors, particularly those on locum or agency shift who may be new to the Trust or new to a clinical area. As part of a range of measures, we've been looking at the induction uh, material that is given to the locum staff, uh, particularly around orientation to the area and the staff that they're working in. I think this is really important that uh, locum staff new to the organisation know the extended team, uh, the local policies and procedures and the limits of the work that they will be undertaking. It's also important that they know that the support is available to them and um, who that is and how to contact with them. To try and help this we've produced a checklist that we'd like every uh, locum or agency doctor to complete when they're new to the organisation or a clinical area that gives them an extra 20 minutes for this induction that allows them to orientate themselves to the organisation, the people and the environment that they are in. One of the requirements is that they contact uh, the consultant who is on call or in charge of the clinical area to introduce themselves and make sure that there are no other things that they should be aware of as far as uh, their current working is concerned. I think it's also important at the end of a locum shift that just with all our trainees we are able to provide uh, feedback through educational and clinical supervisors on their performance. We also ask that the agency doctor gets a feedback form completed about their performance and this can be both for providing constructive uh, feedback to the agency staff but also can be used for us to confirm that patient safety issues are being addressed. I'd be very grateful for your assistance uh, with the checklist uh, and helping the junior uh, doctors on locum shifts to be able to undertake safe and effective clinical working. Thank you.